now just one at a time, grab sure. two or four Many people, when they think of design, think of fashion or the aesthetic of a thing. We look at it a little differently than that. Certainly that's a part of it. But design, the verb, is something that we'd like to get people to pay a little more attention to than design, the noun. And so when we think about design, we think about it from the idea of, uh, of taking something in your imagination, making it in software, allowing you to fail often and early with that thing you're trying to create, and then bring it in to the real world. We sincerely believe that if we can empower the masses, we can democratize design. Imagine if we have billions of people who are doing design, trying new things. Hey, here's an idea. Like the young man who did the TED Talk about how he got parts from the junkyard and made an electrical generator windmill so that he and his family could have a couple of hours of extra light at night so that he can study. That's design. The efficiencies that we're seeing in things today are coming out of design, whether it's a building or a car or an airplane engine, whatever it is. Let's face it, we think about the first beings who picked up a rock and looked at it and said, huh, you know, if I can chip away at this thing a little bit here and here, I can create a tool that will make me more efficient at doing the thing I'm trying to do over here. And of course, someone else looked at that design and said, you know, I can improve upon that design by doing this, or I can take what that person has done with their design and apply it to this other thing over here, and it will help me. Design has been shaping our future since we differentiated ourselves from the other animals like us. And we have been doing that ever since with all our things. We're at the point where we're now able to start designing using cells as hardware and DNA as software. Oh, you would like to have a cancer-eating virus? Great. Here's the text file that describes the DNA of such a virus. Let's go ahead and boot one up that goes out and only attacks leukemia cells. What a wonderful thing that's going to be for us. Sometimes we do it just because we enjoy it and it gives us pleasure. But most of the time, most of the time we do it because it helps us, it helps the world. Design will, of course, continue to drive who we are as humans. Design is everything.